When working with products containing complex organic shapes, the traditional approach of using splines, sketches, and surfaces usually results in spending as much time and effort on how to model than coming up with a conceptual design. The concept stage of the design process should be fluid, not marked by starts and stops as you devise sophisticated methods for describing the aesthetics of your product. The limits of your design tools should not compromise the shape and quality of your product. Built on T-Spline technology, Freeform modeling inside Autodesk Inventor LT provides an entirely different approach. Starting with a primitive surface or by converting existing geometry, designers can work in a natural manner. Simply select points, edges, or faces and utilize the manipulator to move, rotate, or scale the selected objects into the desired form, while always maintaining continuity in watertight surfaces. Supporting this intuitive approach are additional tools that speed up common modeling scenarios. One example is the need to match the freeform body to existing geometry or sketches. Using the Match Edge command, this is done automatically saving time and ensuring a perfect fit. There are also commands for defining symmetry, building bodies together, splitting bodies, creasing edges, and more to keep your design momentum moving forward. Also unique to this modeling approach is the level of control you have without adding unnecessary complexity. For example, locally refining an area by adding edges resulting in T-points, enabling users to add detail in a given area without adding unnecessary edges to the model. Because this is built directly inside Autodesk Inventor LT, there is no concern when exporting and importing models between applications such as repairing and stitching surfaces or restarting downstream engineering efforts if aesthetic changes are needed. When aesthetics, ergonomics, and form are critical to your product, Inventor LT provides the tools you need to explore and iterate, while directing all your effort and focus on the design, not the software.